Any words for Ava Lee? Keep going. To the end. I, I expect I expect this. Today is Ava Lee. Uh, today is June 6th and it's Ava Lee's pre-K. Yeah. Pre-K into kindergarten. <laughs> I got too many of them. Graduation. Okay, what are you gonna say to Ava? We'll say congratulations. Say yeah. congratulations. Good job. Good, deep, deep, deep. She's gonna take that and keep that with her. That advice, she's gonna keep it. Come on back. Slow run. Come on, Kai, come back. Nay, please say something nice. <laughs> Your father's crazy, mm -hmm. but it's okay. Yeah. You got this. We're gonna succeed together, all of us. All of us. Oh, you know the sad part. The sad part about having more than one kid. Last year, I knew the dates and the times, and I was prepared for Alana. Hey, Kai, come back. And I was prepared for Alana today. Um, I had received a. Um, they gave you a little paper talking about Ava's thing, but I didn't fully read it. <laughs> So I thought it was just a cookout. It wasn't, and you know, I just thank the Holy Spirit because something told me to check it again. And that's when I saw a celebration because I actually this morning had her school uniform on. And then that's when I looked at it and saw that it was the actual ceremony and I got everything done. But see, that's the problem with the second kid. You just, in the second and the third, you, not that you don't care and you don't love them, but you're so relaxed. You're just like, let's just do this. Let's get to school, you know. With the first, I, I was worrying and you know, I just remember this nervous, but now I'm just like, we got this, so pros and cons of having more than one kid. The first kid, you worry, you're nervous, you're anxious, but you're so prepared for everything because you're so worried and nervous and anxious. The second one, you're more relaxed, but you gotta be, be careful with that because you don't want them to feel like they don't matter as much because they matter just as much. Actually, I think I'm talking because I gotta go get her sister. Hold on, let me go get Lala. So I just called down Alana. Hopefully she, you know, I know my child, so she probably sitting there like, does somebody just say my name? Does somebody say my name? Hopefully. Hopefully she'll get the message and come on down. I think this might be her. I hope so. So we can go see. So excited. How cute is this little reading corner for them? This is just in the hallway, this little reading nook. It reminds me of um, Harry Potter when each uh, of the things had their own little quarters, meeting quarters. Love their school. So adorable in their playroom, in my next house, when they have their own playroom, I'm gonna have something like this. So excited. I couldn't find her, but I got her. We here, we made it. Thank you, Holy Spirit. You told me, come around one more time. Listen to the Holy Spirit. Come on, girl. Thank you, Jesus. More of the story, only have one kid. It's like, <laughs> he is beautiful. Her teacher, Miss Warner, just had a baby, and then she came back to, to let them graduate. That's their special guest. And Ava is in love with her teacher, and her teacher's in love with her. Look at her. Queenie. See? I know! Yeah. Yeah, Ava! Ava! Ava, hold up your thing! I am so, we are all so proud of you and we are so excited and we are so happy you had a great year and we know next year is going to be even better. It's so light, I can't. It's so light. Proud of you. Okay. Okay, so that was, I'm home now, that was Ava Lee Lynn's uh, pre-K graduation into kindergarten. 
I am just so blessed to have that school. Um, I love that school. I love her teachers. Um, the pictures you saw was her teacher, Miss Warner, and then you had Miss Cotman, and they just adored Ava all year. And it just blesses my soul because I had people come up to me constantly and tell me how Ava's smile just lights up a room and how wonderful and helpful she is. And that just, as a parent, just gives me that 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 confirmation that my kid is a nice kid and that I'm you know I'm you know me and Jay Rao are doing a you know a good job I mean we know what we're doing but you know actions speak louder than words and for people to come up and say that her actions represent the teaching and the parenting that we are putting in makes me feel amazing like just makes me feel amazing so I want to thank you guys Ching, to the end um, I would like to thank you all for subscribing to my family. I already know that you did because you love us. You saw the, you saw the video. You saw Ava Lee smile. You can't help but not love us. So, uh, yeah, definitely subscribe. Um, hit the bell uh, so you can get reminders when we come up. Share Ava Lee uh, vlog with others and her smile and her journey and her special day with others. And if you do that hashtag us on all social media by Ava's mom so if you want to share it on Twitter or Instagram or Facebook just making sure you hashtag so I can thank you for supporting my family because it means so much to me that you guys support us um, if you're new to the channel we have been on YouTube for about four years now um, <laughs> I am a stay-at-home mom of three girls and uh, J. Rowe is amazing. He's the dad. And then you have Alana, who's the oldest sister that you saw with the long hair. And then you have my Ava Lee, who graduated today. And then Aiden Bader wasn't in this vlog because she has her graduation is tomorrow. So you'll see that I'll, I'll, I'll be more prepared because uh, I know her graduation is tomorrow. And I would like you to keep us in prayer. That's what I need. I need y'all to all pray for me. I love my kids' school, but... Uh, what happened was last year it just seemed like because Ava was in the school that uh, Ava, I mean, Lala was in the school first and then Ava came. So it just switched right over. So we thought the same process applied for Aiden coming in because Ava was already in school and Alana's already in school. But they told us today, which broke my heart a little bit, is that it's a waiting list for, um, for you to get on. And it's eight people in front of us. And I really, truly love that school and I want... And I, I want Aiden to start in that school because that school is amazing. And a part of me as a mother feels like I should have been, I should have known. So I got to choose another feeling because that's not the feeling. Everything happens for a reason. So not my will, God's will. So whatever he has in store for Aiden is going to be for the best. Everything is working together for the good. But I am praying because that's what... The mama and me wants, that's my intention, I want my baby to get in that school with her other sisters and start her journey in that school because it's an amazing school and I love the diversity and I love, I can go on for hours and I just was supposed to say goodbye but clearly I run my mouth. But um, yeah, so I would like you all to keep Aiden Baden in prayer that the, the lady will call someday this week and say that somebody decided to skip out and you know and everybody who on the wait list didn't pick up the phone or whatever you know whatever they you know their journey i want their journey to be good but i want what i <laughs> what i want for my baby but i also know that it's not my will it's god's will so whatever he has planned for aiden next year is going to be the best for her and the best for this family i i, I know that to be true so i have to pick a new emotion my first emotion was guilt because you want what's best for your babies and just feeling like you should have found out and not assumed anything because you know when you assume you make a you make a butthole out of yourself so I shouldn't assumed but I did and I feel guilty about that but I am thank God in advance for everything that he's doing and working it out for us and it'll be for the best but also if you know we all come together in unison and you know put those prayers up that Aiden Baden gets in next year and starts then that's what I want to do so I'm excited I will see you guys in the next one once again I love you guys I'm praying for you guys comment below and say whatever you want to say give a thumbs up tell Aiden Bay Ava you know good job because the girls love y'all comments and stuff like that and follow us on social media like Ava's mom and I will see you in the next goodbye